Hi, my friends. So today during our Zoom, I told you that we were going to be reading a story. So I have the book, I Can Save the Earth. And this is Max, and he's a monster who likes to litter and never, ever recycles. So we're going to read all about that and see what happens. Here we go. Max, the little monster, liked to fling candy wrappers, and he left a trail of trash wherever he went. Max, the little monster, did not like to give away his whole old toys, even when he had outgrown them. Look how dirty he is. Max, the little monster, liked to overflow the sink. Uh-oh. And the bathtub. And clog the toilet. Hungry toilet, said Max. Look at that. That is a disaster. Max, the little monster, left the lights on and blared the TV, even when he wasn't in the room. No big whoop, said Max. Then one night, in the middle of his favorite show, something unexpected happened. What do you think happened? The lights went out and the TV went off. There had been a blackout. Uh-oh, how does he look? Maybe a little scared? Hey, shouted Max. Who turned out the lights? Max tripped over some of his old toys and stumbled outside to see what was wrong. Max looked around and he saw a full moon as it shone brightly on the colorful spring flowers. He heard the crickets chirp and the owls hoot. He even saw a shooting star as it twinkled across the sky. Wow, said Max, this is so beautiful. When the lights came back on, Max the little monster felt something new. And he began to notice things that he hadn't noticed before. He didn't realize how beautiful the earth was. In the summer, Max the little monster went to the beach and noticed the pretty shells. He wiggled his toes in the sand, and he watched the sun sparkle on the waves. He saw a dolphin leap out of the water. Do you think that he liked watching nature? I think so. He looks very happy. Max picked up an old bottle and an ice cream wrapper and threw them in the trash can. Pollution makes the beach look ugly, said Max. And pollution can hurt the animals and plants. Pollution is all of the litter and trash that we find on the, floor, on the ground when we're walking or inside of the ocean. Sometimes it's oil spills or pollution can be the gas that's in the air that's not good to breathe in. In autumn, Max the Little Monster noticed the colorful leaves. Red, orange, and yellow. He jumped in leaf piles with his friends. Leaves are so pretty and much more fun to play with than watching TV. After they jumped in on the leaves, Max the Little Monster didn't want to leave a mess, so he composted the leaves. Rotten leaves help the dirt grow happy flowers. In winter, Max the Little Monster noticed the wonders of snowflakes. Each snowflake looked like a crystal jewel. And he made a T-Rex, an igloo, and a snow angel. 
Why didn't I see this before? asked Max. The earth is so beautiful. Now Max the little monster never wastes water. More water, more snowflakes, says Max, and he doesn't waste the toilet paper. Now Max the little monster never wastes electricity. He turns off the lights except for the ones that he is using. He hardly ever watches television, but when he does, he turns it off when his show is over. Let's play outside, says Max. Fresh air feels good on my fur. Now Max the Little Monster never litters. He recycles any paper, aluminum cans, and plastic bottles that he uses. See this one right here is for cans. This one is for plastic or glass bottles. And this one's for paper. Max also likes to eat fresh fruit instead of candy and drinks water instead of soda pop. Tasty, says Max, and he always throws his trash away in the right bin. Max the Little Monster even has yard sales where he sells all of his old toys. Max also trades his toys with his friends. Wow, said Max. Old toys I've never played with before are just as fun as brand new toys. Now Max the Little Monster loves the earth. He reduces the amount of water and the energy he uses. He finds ways to reuse many things as he can and recycles his trash. Sometimes he even hugs trees. Max the Little Monster is now called Max the Little Green Monster. You can be a little green monster too and help save the earth. The end. I hope you guys like that story. I'll see you guys tomorrow.